Welcome to Aries Love Tarot 444, guys. Hope you guys are doing well today. All right. This is going to be a genuine reading for the Aries Collective. If you're new to my channel, welcome. If you're returning, welcome back. Gang, gang, gang. What's good, Aries? Okay. You can have Aries anywhere in your chart. It does not have to be your sun sign. It could be soon, sun, moon, rising, Venus, north node, whatever here for this reading to resonate with you. Okay. Male or female, take the energy as it resonates. This can be past, present, or future energy. Okay, roles can be reversed. All right. If it does not resonate, please does not try to make it. Please do not try to make it sit, um, fit your situation here. Okay. If you guys want to book a personal reading with me, that information along with anything else you need to know about me will be in the description box. Okay. Let's see what we got going on for Aries. Our Angel Michael and Sister Thais White Light. Please come down and protect me as I open myself up to channel the energy for the Aries collective, please. And thank you. Going to start with some tea, guys. Okay. And 11 on the timer. What do we have for Aries spirit today? Start with the tea. We got walking away. Walk away. Explain this feeling. Birds talking outside, okay? So, and this person is outside as well. All right, so some of you could actually be um, taking a walk right now to clear your mind about something here, okay? You could be out in nature, you could be barefooted, you guys could be out grounding here, okay? What else for Aries? What else for Aries? We got mental prison. And we have a role model. Okay. So some of you could be walking away from some kind of profession that you guys were in. It was something that kept you guys um, mentally like tired here. Okay. Because you could have very well been against some of the processes or how they handle their employees or some of the things that this company stood about, okay? So I feel like you guys may have just recently um, left something, left some kind of um, some kind of job situation here, okay? You just figured out that it wasn't for you, all right? That won't be for everybody. Take it as it resonates. What else do we have for Aries? And since you guys um, left this job situation or whatever it is, I feel like a lot of people are looking up to you because they may have felt like you didn't have the strength to do it here. Okay. What else for Aries? Yeah, we got sabotage. Whatever it is, it had you guys really... Um, I feel like you feel like you were really stuck, okay? Something definitely went against some kind of values that you guys had. We got eavesdropping and acting a fool, yeah. You guys may have turned up when you walked away from this situation here. Okay, they may have tried to turn up on you. Somebody was eavesdropping. Like, um, something could have been a setup here to sabotage you in some kind of way. What else for Aries? Yeah, we got jealous. A whole lot of jealous people around you. A whole lot of people could have walked away from you because you're standing in your truth right now about something. That just means that these people were fake, fake as hell. Okay, what else for Aries? No new friends. No new friends. No, no, no. You guys could have said that you didn't want no new friends, but these people don't want you to have no new friends here. <laughs> Yeah, what, what else for Aries? Yeah, these people are going to feel, either they're going to feel or they already feel ignored while you're here. It's right under mental prison. Okay, somebody feels like you're not giving them any more time and energy on you. They're projecting whatever this is here. Okay, they're projecting their unhealed wounds on you. All right, these people um, very well could have some abandonment issues. They could have been aban abandoned by their parents and the, the um. When there was a child here. Okay. I'll take cars on the floor. What else for Aries? Yeah, look. I said it. Fake. And married here. Okay. Some of these people um 
Some of you could have just walked away from the marriage. Others of you, these people could have walked away because you just got married. And they feel like you guys wouldn't have a friendship anymore. Okay. So they could automatically be trying to um, come between you guys already. For the ones that did just recently get married. If you did, congratulations as well. Okay. These people could have did like some kind of... Um, they could have did something that caused the tension at your wedding. Like they could have tried to take over... They could have tried to take over here. Yeah, we got stalking. They were definitely watching, trying to see what they could do to get some kind of attention here. Can't make it up. We got 12th house, hidden truths and secrets. Okay, they had some kind of agenda here. All right, hidden truths, secrets, dreams. One has hidden strengths and weaknesses, the unconscious and karma. Yeah, these people were unconsciously doing things here. Okay. They, like I said, we got mental prison. So some of the things they were doing, they may not, they knew what they were doing, but they weren't conscious of it, okay? It's like they were moving out of anger. All right, what else for Aries? That walking away card, the first card that was out could be that these people finally leaving you alone because they see that they can't affect you here, okay? Or this is spirit actually moving these people away from you. What else for Aries? Yeah, we got a group. We can't make it up. Could be a few of them here. Okay. We got, mm, mm, I'll say money. Generous and meeting your match. Okay, like I said, some of you could have recently got married. You could have have had a um, car spot on the damn floor. You could have had like a, like a real high dollar wedding here okay and i feel like they could have also been jealous of that but you've definitely met your match okay whoever you just married here is definitely a person all right half a dick on the damn <clears throat> what else for aries spirit? some of you if you didn't just recently get married i feel like you could have just went on a very um like an elegant date or something like that here that was kind of pricey, okay? But I feel like this person is able to do that for you. You are able to do that for each other here. I feel like both of you are really like, um, both of you are high, I ain't gonna say high rollers, but you got a lot of money here, okay? Like I said, one of these people could have been your best friend that was hating on you, okay? This person could be like somebody that's always a bridesmaid, but they've never been, um, like proposed to or they never had a stable commitment or something like that okay yeah see split personality there they have some traumas they need to heal here all right we got jealous out here jealous ignore split personality projecting fake like i said i feel like um they got some kind of trauma that's not being healed in them here and i feel like it's an abandonment wound and they're projecting it on you all right money out here again this person could definitely have money problems you could have been helping this person in some kind of way. And once you got married or in this relationship, whatever, I feel like this person, um, I feel like you took that away from them, okay? And now they're angry about it. Let me get one more, please. Let me get one more, please. You got them birds talking. They probably out there gossiping about you, gossiping about somebody, yep. Because they're intimidated by you and they could be a false twin or like a false soulmate. Soulmates can be anybody, okay? It doesn't have to be a lover. It could be a friend as well, okay? But whoever it is, they're very intimidated because you're getting everything that you called in here. All right. Yeah. Bottom of the deck, we got feeling trapped. They don't know what they're going to do if you cut them off here. They could be codependent on you in some kind of way. Let's see what we got from the tarot for Aries. We got from the tarot for Aries. Yeah, they feel like you could be taking their family away or they could consider you family and you kick them out of your life with the Ten of Cups in reverse, something like that. Yeah, Temperance in reverse. They don't, um, they don't feel protected here. You could have been an actual protector for this person. All right. What we got from the tarot for Aries spirit. Mm. 
What do we got for the tarot of Aries? What do we got for the tarot? We got a page of wands. Okay, so you um you received some good news here. You could have just recently got news about a new job with this money out here. Okay, again, Queen of Cups, you just got a you, I feel like you just got married or something like that here. Okay, Queen of Cups is somebody that's very compassionate. Okay, cares about a lot of people. This person, person has a lot of emotions about everybody. You could have recently just had a baby as well with your new person here. Okay, and they could be hating on that. You take care of your family. You make sure your kids are good here. Okay. Ten of Cups here. Yeah, you take care of your family. All right, and I feel like these people don't like that because again, I feel like you cut off access or any funds to them. Actually, it's three babies up here. Okay, it's two more at the top. Okay, so you could have three kids here. Maybe confirmation for someone. All right, 11, 11 on the timer. We got a Knight of Swords and the Five of Pentacles. Yeah, I can't make it up. Somebody feels like you are totally abandoning them and they angry as hell about it, okay? <clears throat> mm -hmm. I couldn't even shuffle when three of swords popped out. Yeah, somebody's feeling very betrayed by you. They're feeling very heartbroken. I feel like you stabbed them in the heart, but I feel like this is somebody who's been mooching on you kind of their whole life here. All right. That's too many. Well, the only one that flipped over was the seven of wands. Yeah, you, you blocked them out. Can't make it up. You could literally have them on all kinds of blocks. Okay. What Dewana say? <laughs> What's the Dewana manifestation said? Call him Blockiana. Okay, I know that's right. <laughs> what else we got for Aries? We got Seven of Pentacles and the Two of Cups. Yeah. You guys are in love here, 1212 on the timer. You guys are ready to put a lot of um a lot of investments in whatever you guys just created here. Okay, and nobody's gonna be able to come between that. All right. Nobody can fuck that up for you here. What else for Aries? Your love is the one in a million. It goes on and on and on. What else for Aries, spirit? That's could be seeing 777. We got the seven of pentacles and the seven of um seven of wands. Okay. Person is ready to invest in a family with you. What else for Aries? Six of Swords in reverse. This best friend, jealous person, whoever it is, trying to keep you from moving forward here. Okay, but you got the star and the moon. All right, you guys are balanced with each other here. Okay, Aquarius and Pisces energy. All your wishes are getting fulfilled, okay? You may need to do some things in secret here, all right? Or just keep some of your blessings out of the public eye for now, okay? Until things 1333 are clear with this, um, with this friend here, all right? What else for Aries? Could be dealing with a, um... Scorpio here. Okay, this is a Pisces card, but it's a scorpion down there. So it could be a Scorpio, Aquarius, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. What else for Aries? Yeah, Six of Wands. You guys are very successful now, okay? Things are definitely moving forward, okay? I feel like you have your crown here and your person just crowned you as well. Okay, so you guys definitely are in some kind of union here. Okay, it's I feel like if you look down here, this person in the back side, they got like a mean mug, a mean mug on their face here. Okay, so they're definitely um, in the shadows, hating and shit. All right. What else for Aries? Four cups in the reverse. Don't want to feel rejected by you. Okay. I feel like this hand that's coming out of the clouds right here is spirit telling this person to heal. 
okay but well, that's not what they trying to do they want to stay dependent on other people and they're going to stay stuck what else for aries What else for Aries spirit? Look, I can't make it up. Wheel of Fortune, Ace of Swords in the reverse. They're going to stay stuck. They're going to stay on this karmic wheel. They're not going to ever have any clarity until they decide to go within and do the work on themselves here. Okay? Taurus, Virgo, Leo, Scorpio. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. What else? The Aries. The Empress, because that's what the fuck you are here. Okay, which is why this person is hating on you. 1555 on the timer. Like I said, you could be a mother, a wife as well here. Okay, you are standing in your power. You shining bright. You just sitting there like I wish a bitch would. Okay, but of course nobody's gonna try you, which is why this person is just hating from the background. Okay, could be dealing with the cars. You could also be pregnant right now. But you see these trees behind her? Everything she do is abundant. Okay, everything she do is fruitful here. What else for Aries? Yeah, I knew it. Look, the hyphen and the empress. Okay, definitely a higher level of commitment here. This is also two Taurus energy. Okay, strong Taurus here. Definitely two spiritual people. All right. What else for Aries? Anything else from the tarot? Page of Cups in the reverse. Now, look, I can't even get that back in there and it's flipped over. Page of Cups in the reverse and the devil here. Okay, somebody's definitely trying to manipulate you in some kind of way with your emotions or whatever. But again, this person is blocked out with this Page of Cups in reverse. They can't come to you any kind of way. Okay, they are being blocked. All right. And any kind of evil eye, magic, negativity, anything they've been sent, sending to you, it was little and it's not working. Okay. Yeah. You guys are going to be staying together here. Let's stay together. Don't do it for the kids. Do it for me. <laughs> okay. So, again, definitely you guys could have kids together with this person. Or you could have kids with this person that's trying to keep you from um from moving on here. That's trying to keep you stuck or whatever. Yeah, you got to overcome obstacles. All right. Let's see what we got from the goddess deck for Aries. And however, card is a card of marriage as well. And I said some of you could have recently got married here. Okay. Message that we have from the goddesses spirit for Aries 1818 on the timer. The message that we have for Aries Girl, I apologize for your pain. <laughs> we gotta be open to change here. You guys made a whole lot of changes, all right, and cut these people out of your life, regardless of who it is here, because they were trying to keep you stuck. All right, what else for Aries? Manifested this whole new person that you guys have here, okay? If you don't have anybody, then this is who's coming in for you because you let go of these family members or friends or ex-lovers or whatever it is here, okay? What else? Can't make it up. Lovers and released. You release one and got another. Got a true one here. Okay. All I can do is be real. All I can be do is true. All I can do is be true. Okay. Anything else? Anything else, Aries? Patience. You guys were patient here. All right. And I feel like this person that you have recently married or come into contact with is very patient with you as well. This person could be your twin flame. All right. Let's see what we got from the romance angels. This person, 
I tell you, they try to make you release your lover. All right. What else for Aries? Let's do it again. Cause I want to make sweet love to you, baby. Let's do it again. Could have been somebody that you guys slept with, but didn't have a relationship with. That's trying to hold you here. Let's see what else we got. What we got from the romance angels? We got a flirt, yeah. So like I said, somebody that you guys could have had or like a one night stand with or something like that. Somebody you could have just flirted with. And they could have like caught feelings for you instantly, even if you didn't have sex with this person. Okay. So to extend your lighthearted energy to others. I feel like you guys are just positive like that. Some people, you could be a queen of wands. We are Aries. Okay. We're known to be like very sexy, confident. Okay. People just think we have like a good high sex appeal and then we just play games, but that's just naturally come with a fire sign here. Okay, that's too many. What else for Aries? Shit, I don't know how to flirt. Now I'm a damn queen of wands. I ain't even gonna lie to you. I'm just <laughs> be feeling awkward as hell. But okay, that's my personality. So it is what it is. Play from the center reverse. Look, can't hey, make it up. Okay. Some of you may feel the same way. Like you don't um, really know how to let go. You don't really know how to open up, let your inner child flow free here. But you got you gave this person a chance here and this person put a ring on it and they married you here, okay? For those of you that's not married, this person is just um, willing to do, take things slow with you, do it by the book, do it the right way here, okay? What else for Aries from the Romance Angels? We got finances and career and separation. Okay, so like I said, some of you could have um, just recently separated from a job. Okay, it says financial issues are affecting your love life time apart from your partner is on the horizon. Okay, so like I said, for some of you, this person that's hating and jealous of you, this person could have been somebody that you work with. Again, with separation and finances and career, they're mad because you stopped providing for them financially. All right. Codependency and codependency and unrequited love in the reverse. Yeah, there's no more. Um, you're not helping this person anymore. They were too dependent on you here. Okay, and they could have also been have some other addictions that they were dealing with as well. Okay. <clears throat> yeah. Wait a minute, don't you hear me, baby? It's gonna be all right. We don't have to fight. Yeah. Forgiving and learning and chemistry. This person, whoever this hating ass person is, could come in and falsely want your forgiveness here. Okay, because they feel like you got some kind of chemistry with them, but it definitely could be one sided here. We got unrequited love in reverse. Okay. Yeah, very soon. Very soon, I feel like they may try to come and ask you for something else here, or very soon they may try something here. Okay. So you got, let's get some more tea. Yeah. What else we got for Aries? Get all the way to the bottom. Mm -mm -mm. And I say something about three kids a while ago. I did. Three kids could be significant here. Okay, don't be so hard on yourself. I feel like this is what you need to tell this person that's trying to fuck you up here. Like I said, this person has some kind of trauma that they have not healed and that they still need to work on. All right, somebody named Stacy could be significant. Again, about respect. You gotta learn how to respect yourself before you expect somebody else to respect you here, okay? So they just need to fall back, all right? I regret ever leaving you. Again, this person could have been somebody that you were very close with and they could have um they could have like took their friendship away from you. Just don't be a had to, had to be a lover here. Could be anybody that was real close connected to your energy that just fell back off of you for no reason. Again, they were projecting their energy. Okay. 14, uh 24, 44 on the time. And somebody could have a peanut allergy here, be allergic to peanuts. Somebody could be a night worker. All right, New York. 
could be significant here. Somebody could be jobless or homeless, all right? Could be why this person may try to come to you here and get something else from you. They could be about to lose a home, okay? Fuck family, get money, yeah. Like I said, they're coming to you. Definitely could be a family member here, all right? And then a victim right behind it. Somebody about to lose a home, okay? So they definitely may need your help, but I don't feel like you may offer them, okay? I want you to sit on my face. Definitely could have been somebody that you were sexually active with. DF is the only option. Your person knows that, and that's why they're not going anywhere. Okay, color red could be significant to you. You guys could be about to have a candlelit dinner here. Okay. Let's get some kipper. What we got from the kipper for Aries. We got from the keeper for Aries spirit. So welcome in reverse. Look, I make this shit up now. They don't have no money. We got for Aries spirit. Add to me, add to me. What can you add to me? Add to me. What can you add to me? Okay, this person always trying to subtract some shit from you. What can they add to you here? Okay, then the type of people that you need, that you um guys support each other equally here. Friend group or whatever it is, all right? We don't need no haters. Everybody work together. Everybody rising up. Everybody on their same shit. Everybody helping each other rise here, okay? What else for Aries? If they ain't helping you, uplifting you or whatever, then you got the wrong people in your circle, Aries, okay? Snakes in your grass, cut your grass. What else we got for Aries? We knocking heads off. Chop them snakes heads off. Okay. <laughs> what else for Aries? What we got from the Kipper? It's too many. Anything from the Kipper spirit? Anything from the Kipper? We got official person, <laughs> okay? Definitely official. We got wealthy man and message in reverse here, okay? So definitely the person that you guys are with or could be married to right now. I felt this person could be a doctor, a lawyer, a judge, okay? I feel like there could be something in the, ju just ju in the court systems here, okay? This person could have been with them for a while, so this person definitely could be older, all right? But with a message in reverse, I just feel like whoever this person is that's trying to get in contact with you, you definitely has have this person on block, okay? This person that you're um dealing with, married to, connected to, whatever. This person could be 22 years old. You could have met this person 13 years ago. 13, yeah, 13 years ago. Um, 13 days ago, okay? You could be about to get married um, in 13 days. The 13th of something may be significant here. January the 3rd as well. What else for Aries? February uh, 2nd. What else for Aries? On the Kipper. Yeah, we got Sutton Will. This wealthy man, you could have married into a, uh, a wealthy family. You, this person, and their family could be wealthy here, okay? You guys could be about to go on a trip to the casino, okay? What is that? Could be three people also that's hating on you guys here. They just look like uh, little joker faces, okay? So just be aware of that as well. Um, the letters M or C could be significant. First or last name, MC. Somebody could be a DJ. All right, confirmation. What else I see here? Okay. 
Guys could love to play um could love to play checkers as well or chess. Anything else for Aries? Could be seeing 777, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11. What else for Aries? 7777. Seven, seven, seven. We got four sevens here. What else for Aries? Too many. Anything else from the Cupid Spirit? Poverty. Lovers here again. False person. Okay, so somebody's mask was definitely shown to you. All right. Again, I feel like this person was financially tied to you. They were financially tied to you in some way. Okay. Could have been regarding a child that you have with this person. Okay. You could be pregnant right now with the person that you just got married to. And this person just feels like you're not going to be able to financially help them. Okay. Because you're pregnant now. Okay. That's what I'm getting here. They just feel like they're going to be left out with nothing. All right. So in this person's mind, we got mental prison here. In this person's mind, they could have actually thought that they had some kind of connection with you. Okay. They could have thought in their mind they were in a relationship with you. But this person was had some mental issues. Okay. Again, this child, this person needs some inner child healing with their abandonment wounds. This child looks like they're left out in the cold. Like I said, this person got some abandonment issues that still need to be worked on. Okay. Person definitely needs to tap into their intuition with this black cat here. All right. So I feel like this person could have also been closed off for a while. So they could only, they could feel like you're the only friend that they have or had. Okay. Yeah. Well, let's see what we have to close this reading out for Aries spirit. What do we have for Aries to close this reading out? Could be dealing with the Gemini as well here with the lovers. Okay. What do we have for Aries to close this reading out from our God spirit? What else do we have to close this reading out? Shit. My soul light just broke. What the fuck? <laughs> what else do we have for Aries spirit? The light bulb broke off. Okay. Somebody could be trying to dim your light, this person. Very toxic, very energy draining. Okay. What else do we have to close this reading now? The Aries spirit. Somebody's mad that you're leaving them. They're going to be talking shit to you. Hear those birds. We got spring equinox. Something's definitely about to go on right now. Okay, we are in the spring. You guys have went through some kind of transformation. Like I said, with this rabbit energy as well. You guys are very fertile. I said you could be pregnant right now. Giving rebirth to something. What else for Aries? We got pure intentions because you, your intentions are very pure. And whoever this person is, they're very devilish, very toxic. Okay, very low vibe here. All right, but you guys are very of the light here. All right. Number two could be significant to you guys. You could be seeing two, 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 but I feel like you're at a lot of peace right now with this dove here. Okay. Find clarity, surrender your ego, all right? Like I said, this is also for this person. 
We had the Ace of Swords in the reverse and the moon. This person is not clear, 3444 in the time of their protection. They're not sure of their protection. They're not clear of what direction they need to be going in. Okay, this person needs some help. This person needs to go within to heal. So they can get their abundance. It's like you're getting yours here, okay? Could be saying 888, believe you deserve, accept plenty and prosperity. Again, they got trauma that they need to heal from, okay? Because they don't believe in themselves. All right. Let me get one more, please, Chris. So let's read it out. I'll never take my power. My power. Okay. Can't take my power. So satisfaction here because everything feels good to my soul. Okay. Everything feels good to the soul. That's how you know that you're moving in the right direction here. Aries 23 could be significant to you guys. Magical crystal cave. Switch on your inner light and bring forth your gifts. Okay. 3555 on the timer. Like I said, my light just broke down there. <laughs> okay. Switch on your inner light. That means nobody can never stop your light here because it's within. They can't touch you, okay? 21 could be significant. Bottom of the deck. <clears throat> Bottom of the deck, we got caring community because you got your ancestors all around you. You got a whole lot of people that'll go to war for you right now. You ain't got love for motherfucking finger. None of that shit, okay? And I think these people are aware of that. All right. <laughs> Number 25 could be significant. Breaks down to a seven. Like I said, protected. Ancestors all around you. Spiritual protection. They can't touch you. Can't do shit. That one is flipped over down here. Look for the signs. Signs all through this reading. That light breaking was a fucking sign. That somebody wants to break your light. Somebody wants to break you. Somebody could want to physically fight you. Okay. And you know how to handle that, Aries. All right. Again, on this card, it's 11. Like I said, 11 and 33. Like I said, you could be seeing 333. Look for those signs. Look for those rainbows. Look for those blessings that you're going to keep getting because keep people keep fucking with you. Okay. Yeah. And another dove right there. They can't fuck with your peace. Whatever they do, Aries. All right. Fuck them. And that's how we gonna end that, Aries. Okay. <laughs> Bottom of that deck. As soon as I shuffle. Promise. You getting what's promised to you. Okay. That rainbow. But that's what I have for you, Aries. If anything did resonate with you, please like the video for me so I can get my content out there. Comment, share, and subscribe. Everything you guys need to know about me will be in the description box. I'm sorry for this squeaky chair, guys. I got to figure out something to do with this, okay? But this is what I got to use for right now. So if the squeakiness bothers you, um, feel free to exit out of the video. All right. <laughs> um, yeah, anything else, guys, that you need to know about me will be in the description box, okay? Till next time, Aries, I will holla at y'all later, gang, gang, gang.